There's a little neighborhood secret in the North Park area of San Diego. And it only happens for a couple of hours, one day a week. But if you're in the right place at the right time, you'll stumble upon it and once you do, you'll be sure to go back time and time again. It is the North Park Farmer's Market on the corner of 30th Street and North Park Way. And it's filled with sights, sounds, smells, and tastes that make this farmer's market a wonderful part of their neighborhood. And that's especially true because everything is locally made. And did I say everything is locally made? Well, yes, virtually everything is locally made. Wine, obviously it's a farmer's market, so lots of produce, fruits and veggies. Um, handcrafted grocery items, clothing, jewelry, candles, everything exactly, you can imagine. Exactly That's Eden Hughes. She's the operations director, and if there's anyone who's hooked on a farmer's market, it's her. She runs three of them. You're at the North Park Thursday market. We have Tuesday in Pacific Beach, and then we have Saturday in Little Italy. It's called the Little Italy Mercado. On this particular Thursday, we ran into all kinds of vendors, from those preparing family recipes to those selling fresh food grown on the family farms. There are a lot of farmers markets around the country, but here we get the best of both sides of the border just by walking down the street. And of course, there's Bill Fleming. You'll find him here every Thursday playing his guitar and entertaining everyone who walks by him. You'll also find some true success stories, like David Mead, the creator of Baby Clydesdale, a crowd favorite. David is a relative newcomer to the world of neighborhood farmer's markets. But his sauces are selling like crazy and business is booming. And he owes it all to farmer's market. It's a lot of fun. It's really fun to make your own product and sell it because you can get behind it and you believe in it and it's, it's a lot of fun. There are a lot of reasons to visit the North Park Farmer's Market. Lots of food, flowers, fruits and vegetables and of course one other thing. You're guaranteed to have a, a good laugh um, just coming and having fun and enjoying the markets. It may be lights out for today but one thing is for sure. The next time I have some free time on a Thursday afternoon I'm heading back to the North Park Farmer's Market to visit my new friends because the North Park Farmer's Market is exactly the reason we have the best of both worlds right here on La Border Girl.